Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. Welcome to the distinctive Al Bayt Stadium with its tent-like structure. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Stuart, what are you expecting? Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Kareem Hassan, number 14, Homa. And here's the Qatar starting 11. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. The opposition starting 11. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4 4 2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. And now they get the ball rolling. A very good tackle. Ibarra. Takes on the shots. And the keeper there to deal with it. And he's fired over the corner. Well, the danger is still there. And there it is! The opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Grueso. On to Estupiñan. Carlos Grueso. He's got to score! Well, not troubling the goalkeeper at all there. And from that sort of distance, you should be troubling the goalkeeper. Technique let him down there. Abdulaziz Hatem. And a timely intervention. No luck keeping possession. Oh. 
Ibarra. Can they convert? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Well, a successful intervention, winning the ball back. Ibarra. Ener Valencia. Piero in Capier. And now with Estupinian. Plenty of options. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Carlos Grueso. Ibarra. Grueso. That is a really disappointing effort, goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Alhaidos. And there to intervene. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Karim Budiaf. Crossing possibilities. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, they'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Ibarra. We're getting the ball forward. Not a touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. And now the delivery. Disappointing delivery, sailing over everyone in the middle. The outcome is a goal kick here. And giving the ball away. And they need to get tighter. Ibarra. Estupinian in Capier Caicedo well they must exercise caution standing off as they are Pervis Estupinian Ener Valencia and far from a smooth challenge now will the referee produce a card Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Good effort here! Oh, 
fairly run of the mill in terms of what the keeper had to do. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Karim Budiaf, unable to keep the ball that time. Budiaf, theme emerging of wasted possession. He felt he had to blow the whistle. <laughs> Moving forward effectively, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in Akram Afif and intercepts again Karim Budiaf the referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is, and pushed away to safety. They're making high pressing work for them here. Opportunity! Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. And the referee will go back now to the earlier incident. Yellow card it is. So the corner played into the box. Well, far from the ideal header, and the goalkeeper had it all the way. Pedro Miguel well, racing past his man a wonderful intervention how can he take them on and beat them he has time to play it over it was goalkeeper has it well, a successful intervention winning the ball back and the whistle is sounded for half time in this game and the contest begins So back underway here into the second half. Plata. And Mena on the ball. We're racing away here, but no damage done. That's the main thing. Preciado, Grueso, Moises Caicedo. Really sitting deep now, that could be problematic. Torres. Now well, he's given us away. Hassan Alhaidos. Now let's see what they can do here. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Carlos Grueso. Grueso. And since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. 
Carlos Grueso. And space available inside. Preciado. Moises Caicedo. Akram Afif. Almoez Ali. And there to intervene. Angel Mena. Carlos Grueso. Incapié. And Mena on the ball. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Oh, he's given the ball away. What can they do from here? Opportunity to deliver the cross. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. And the keeper's delighted to see that sail well over the bar. Goal kick. Good tackle. Preciado. Caicedo. Ener Valencia. Very quick thinking there. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Valencia. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Hatem. Boudiaf. And Mena on the ball. Options in the centre. And off target in the end. And that'll be a goal kick. Twenty minutes remaining. Ener Valencia. Well read to put an end to that attack. Good movement. A glorious chance. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. And a throw in forthcoming. Abdulaziz Hatem. Karim Budiaf. Hassan Al Haidos. Gives it a go. Well, giving it a go in a bid to hold them back into this one. Well, they're knocking at the door here, but they need to score soon. Grueso Gonzalo Plata the attack continues they're making considerable progress crossing into the middle well they can keep possession of it now a foul but advantage played 
Hatem Alrawi wanted to keep it but couldn't Gonzalo Plata well unfortunately he couldn't keep the shot down Ten minutes to go. Valencia. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. They couldn't maintain possession. Has a go. Pretty simple for the keeper. Throw ins given. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Gonzalo Plata. Angel Mena. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Valencia now looking dangerous here and if you're wondering about added time two minutes it'll be Gonzalo Plata Angel Mena Getting forward. Can he put it away? So with that, we can now say it's all over. And the outcome they were hoping for, certainly. A victory, and you can't argue with that, Stuart. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area. And they also look threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.